Six years ago, the phrase radon testing wasn't talked about much when Joe Hudak was going through the home buying process. Now it's a common test. I think we found out basically going through the home um, you know, purchasing process and selling process. Radon is a radioactive gas that can have long-term health implications, most commonly cancer. It's something to be taken serious, especially you know, now and, and especially with the year that we just had. You know, people are, are looking and, and realizing more of you know, just our health and, and checking things. He and his partner Clarence installed a mitigation system in Hudak's home today. Radon mitigation systems take radon seeping into the house from the bottom floor and disperse it outside through a series of pipes and a fan. I don't ever want to see somebody get sick because of their home. And, and it, it's very, very common in our area, especially northeastern Ohio. You know, it, it, it's the second leading cause of lung cancer in, in the United States. So, I mean, it is a big deal. Since the home was recently purchased, Hudik said he wasn't too worried about the health effects because he knows they're long term. But he's happy it's done. Sense of security that, you know, things have been taken care of and uh, we can feel safe. Corey showed two tests. One takes 48 hours and is more expensive and usually used by professionals. The other homeowners can use. It's cheaper but takes longer, about two to four days, and is sent to a lab for results, which come back in about a week. Both tests are left in the basement and read the levels of radon coming into the home. Testing is a big deal in January, you know, being Radon Awareness Month. It, it's a good time for everybody to think about, you know, having their house checked out and seeing if it's something that they need to, you know, take care of. In Poland, for WKBN 27 First News, I'm Brandon Jaycees.